Okay, hi, this is Sarah Levine. Um, we are about to do a jugular draw on Miss Clementine. Um, this is for Vet 220. Um, so I've got my supplies over here. I've got my alcohol, my needle, which I've gone with a 22 gauge and a 3cc syringe. Um, and then we've got our blood tubes as well. So first off, I'm just going to go ahead and make sure Sonia's got a good hold on her. And I'm going to push into the thoracic inlet so I can try to get that jugular to pop up to see if I can palpate it. So once it's palpated, I'm going to go ahead and put some alcohol on there. This is going to help clear the, I know it's cold, make sure the hair is to the side so it makes it a little bit easier for visual. Okay, so after I've palpated again, I'm going to go ahead and poke. And I'm going to sit. Come in time. Hey, Bianca. Do you want to help just hold her legs? So Bianca's going to help hold the legs so we got a little fun in time. Staying safe and everyone else staying safe. Okay, so I've palpated it. Um, there's still alcohol in there, so I'm going to go ahead and poke it out. I'm going to make sure I'm poking with the bevel up. And then we're going to go ahead and pull back. I'm going to release pressure and put some over the site where I coat and then have Sonia hold off so we make sure we don't get a hematoma. I'm going to go ahead now and fill my tubes making sure to let the vacuum suck in the blood and make sure that it gets the correct amount. And then I'm going to dispose of this in the sharps and then we're going to label this with her name and the date for today. What's her last initial? Six, seven, seventeen. All right, so now that I have those both labeled, I'm going to go ahead and check her neck, make sure everything looks good, which it does, just good girl, and then we're all set. <laughs>